I can't be pleading for sex. Like, trust me, I can't. If you're not offering, somebody else will. <laughs> I mean, I just can't believe Ghost never told me he had a girlfriend. Now you're just saying those things because you're jealous. Like, you listen to me, I am hey, not hey, 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 this doesn't have to turn into a fight. We're not fighting. It's not a fight. I had never watched the Zambian series before, but when I started watching Tequila, Oh, it blew my mind. I've got this assignment and it's impossible. I mean, there's so much to read and I haven't even started yet. <sighs> School's no joke. I mean, I wish I could be more like Natasha Chansa. She's so smart and intelligent. No wonder Mimi looks up to her so much. <laughs> Just found out Shisha isn't as cool as Fox makes it sound. Does he know it's got tobacco in it? Hey guys, Brenton here. If it's your first time on this channel, please hit that subscribe button and turn on the bell notification. A very big well done to the director, the cast, the actors of Tikula, everyone that's involved in this series, guys, because this series is amazing. A lot happens there. They are the cool people, they are the dry people. They say cool people smoke, they say cool people do not smoke. Hello? Nothing can bring me down. I stay true to myself. So today we're just going to characterize our actors and actresses. Mimi, beauty with no brains. First things first, what is she doing with Fox? Baby, what's going on? We don't have all day. Mimi is so beautiful, but she cannot use her head. Do you guys mind escorting me to the mall today? Oh, no, I can't, sorry. I'm hanging out with Fox and the boys later. Wait. You still want to hang out with Fox even though you know he's got a side chick. Yeah. <laughs> so what am I saying? I'm saying that when a girl has beauty without brains, it's her private parts that suffer the most. Mm -hmm. Then we have Taisia, the mother at school. <laughs> no one at Skywood does that because it's not normal. And do you know that Shisha has got tobacco in it? I'm sure we all have that one friend that tells us, don't do this. Don't go there. Don't do that. She's not right for you. He's not right for you. Who told them? <laughs> no, I, I need to know. Who told them? Just kidding. Just kidding. We've got to appreciate such friends because those friends are very selfless. Look at Taizia. Those people, they are very, very selfless. But the only problem with being this mother figure to everyone is that these people, they don't have a life. These people, they tend to live a boring life at all. You understand? And please don't get me wrong. But honestly speaking, life is for living. You've got to live this life whilst you're still alive. There is nothing wrong with having fun as long as you're having the right kind of fun. So as much as I would like to say, let's be like Taizia, I would contradict that by saying the brave may not live forever, but the cautious do not live at all. I mean, you had her yourself. She said she does not want to get a boyfriend because she's afraid of a heartbreak. Crazy, right? But what do you know? It's not like you've ever been in a relationship. <laughs> well, I'd rather be by myself and avoid unnecessary heartache. Then we have Fox the Predator. I don't like this guy. Honestly speaking, I don't like this guy. I don't even know what Mimi sees in him. You understand? He doesn't even deserve her. Are you dating her? Mm, no. But... Look, you've been holding out and whatnot. She offered. Needs? Yes, needs, Mimi. But don't worry, you're still my number one baby girl, though. First off, you force your girlfriend to smoke. You force your girlfriend to drink. As if that was not enough. You then force your girlfriend to skinny dip. Wait. To take off her clothes in front of other guys to see. Ah, wait. Not just other guys. In front of other horny college guys to see. Your girlfriend, you force her to take off her clothes and jump into the pool whilst other guys are seeing her nakedness. Chai! Ah. Abba. And you still take pictures of her naked and blackmail her saying, if you don't sleep with me, I'm going to post these photos on Instagram. And then you guys are saying I'm overreacting. 
saying I'm hating on the guy. Come on, guys. What's your take on Mimi and Fox's relationship? And why is it that Mimi cannot, can't leave Fox? Why can't Mimi just break up with Fox? Can someone help in the comment section, please? Hey, guys. Hey, What's guys. Up, What's up, ladies? What's up? You good? You doing? Nandi? Okay. Then we have Ghost, the small high school boy. I like the guy. He's cool. But I labeled him as the small high school boy because he's living in a box and he doesn't want to use his mind to think. You're about to be girlfriend grows cold on you all of a sudden. And you don't bother to find out what's wrong. First day, second day, third day. And you're just content. What do you call that? If you're enjoying this video so far, please don't forget, hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification, give this video a thumbs up. Then we have Nandile, the dry girl. Know that her skin is dry, but dry is used for people that are not cool. Then again, I ask, who is the judge of that? Who classifies people as to the cool ones and the dry ones? What marking scheme are they using? So to say Nandele is dry would be very wrong because everyone is cool in their own unique ways. So how can we describe Nandele now? Just one word. Foolish. <laughs> Nandele wanted to go naked. She wanted to drink. She wanted to smoke. Nandele was ready and is ready to do anything just to be labeled as cool. Again, by who? the so-called cool people. Nandile is failing the one lesson from this series, staying true to yourself. I don't know about yourself. What is your takeaway from Tikula? You are evil! No, no. You are a mother. You killed that girl.